Hi, this is Iris from the Cashmere Goat, and I wanted to hop on today to talk to you a little bit how, about how I conceptualize and remember Make One Right and Make One Left in the Ramona cardigan that I'm knitting right now. Um, and that's part of our Ramona knit along that we're doing this winter, and I thought that maybe some other people might find this um, amusing or possibly help you remember too. So I think about it as I'm on Make One Mountain because I always start on the on the tricky side where I'm gonna be ascending the mountain and this is a really steep ascent because to me make one right is hard so look at all these cliffs all these places it's a very steep uh, face of the mountain but I've got to make it through the make one right um, it just always feels more awkward to me personally but once I make it up that tricky part then I'm gonna take a little tiny rest and this is the place where you knit just one stitch plane right to the side of the marker. So I get to catch my breath, knit a plain stitch, and then I'm ready to slip my marker, knit my center stitch, celebrate my success. Wow, I did it, this is amazing. I made it to the top of the mountain, slip my other marker, and then I'm ready to start my descent. And pretty soon, I've got that plain stitch, the one that's right next to the marker. So it's always gonna be that plain knit stitch. So I get to catch my breath, I look at the view, it's great, I'm feeling awesome. And then pretty soon, I'm hitting my make one left right next to that plain stitch. It's easy, It's I get to just sort of skip and sing downhill, and it's a nice gentle descent as opposed to the rugged ascent of the make one right side of the mountain. So that's it, that's how I think about it. Maybe you've got another way that makes sense to you. If so, great, and I uh, hope to see you soon in the shop or online.